My name is Saeed Janale. I um, was one of the 92. I'm about to share a story about what happened that day. My name is Abdikader Osman Raj. I am one of the 92. It's very hard to talk about it, what happened, because it was painful. And, you know, I don't know how to describe because I still remember how it was. We shuckle, and every time when you move, that chain is going to get in tighter and tighter. We chained up from the hands, stomach, and legs. That's when everybody start breaking their silence, like start talking to each other about, oh, we're finally in Africa. Hey, they, you know, you can, hear, you can hear people start talking to the airplane. After two hours, then somebody that is finally say something like, hey, what's going on? Why are we not leaving, you know? An ICE agent got on a microphone and said, hey, uh, something wrong with the airplane. Um, uh, something like the starter or we're missing the load, something breaking the engine. We just contact the American. Somebody from um, America is going to bring uh, the parts. We're just going to wait here and wait for them to bring the parts. We start, we all like, all up, man, somebody, they lying to us. Something don't make no sense. This don't make no sense. One guy tried to stand up because he feel uncomfortable and the, the chain was too tight. So they grab him and they smash him on the ground. And that's what happened. And, uh, you know, like a lot of us, we tried to get up and help. All they do is push the guys in front of you. So he can push the guy who's in front of him, and he can push the guy who's in front of him. They take us out of family and, and put us in the plane for like two days now, chained up, not knowing if we're going to go die, if we continue to go to Africa, Somalia, how long we're going to be here and what's going to happen to us after we see a couple of people getting beat up and getting upset, lift them and punch in your face and your neck. You know, like, they were just, that's not how you treat a human being.